Stalker 1-0, this is Stalker 1-1. Status report, over. Stalker 1-1, this is Stalker 1-0. Leaving Manhattan, entering Brooklyn Battery Tunnel now. Over. Greetings, all you carbon-based life forms out there. No, no, I'm totally kidding. Hey guys, what's up? Physics Science here, bringing you guys a uh, another Modern Warfare 2 commentary, as as usual. Um, today, uh, what we're going to be s discussing is actually the first episode in a uh, playlist slash series that is going to be. Uh, I'm still working on the name, but uh, for now it's going to be like informative commentaries or like knowledge series. But hey, if you guys want to suggest some ideas for this. Um, uh, playlist that I'm going to be discussing about what what's going to be on in a few minutes. Uh, feel free to do so in the comment section. Uh, the gameplay you guys are watching here is a, um, I forget this map, it's on the top of my head. Uh, Quarry, Quarry on Modern Warfare 2. And this is one of the few episodes that I'm actually doing pretty good. Uh, this is like one of my Slayer classes on Modern Warfare 2. Here you see me with my M60, not M64, I was about to say that because I'm so used to it on Modern Warfare 3. Uh, but yeah, you see my gun just doing work, and by that I mean like I'm slaying a whole lot of people. I'm just like firing through walls, trying to be like an MLG pro, thinking I'm all like optic or something. I'm like, ah, come on, I can do this. Just firing through walls. You're gonna be you're gonna be seeing a lot of that kind of um gameplay in the in this commentary. And uh, in addition, yeah, to this gun doing work. Uh, what's so special about this commentary is that this, if it works out to be that long, is going to be my first commentary over 10 minutes now. It's quite an improvement from last time where it was 8 minutes and quite an improvement from my other types of commentaries which were significantly less than 10 minutes. Um, gameplay, yeah, I just said I'm going to be like, in, in some um, circumstances, I think I bite off a little more than I can chew. And I end up just getting completely slain because people were in like uh, teams of two, uh, actually using their environment to their to their um, advantage, whereas I was just completely solo and I had no advantage to myself. So this informative series is uh, a series I came up with, or whatever you want to call it. it, can be like knowledge series or informative. But you guys are still welcome to put um suggestions to what this thing should be named but what I intend on doing for this series is that um, this is gonna be for these commentaries where I try to like discuss matters of a more serious nature like in this in today's episode I'm gonna be discussing hacking and it's like impacts on society if I can actually like uh, try to scoop up all my knowledge that I have about hacking and like and computer hacking and stuff in, in a computer security context and see what I what um, knowledge I can give you guys but that's what that's what's gonna be that's uh, what this informative series is gonna be all about I'm gonna be choosing uh, topics or of course as always you guys can suggest suggest topics for me to discuss in a serious sophisticated manner like I'm about to do now for hacking and feel free to always uh, recommend topics for these these types of commentaries. What I have in mind for future commentaries like these are like um, academic competitions in the United States. I have that uh, hacking right now, um, and that's pretty much it for now. I can't think of others that I would have uh, off the top of my head like right now. Uh, no, no, I, I lied. No, I, I have thought of some more like. Uh, recent events that happened in physics, stuff like that, I can be discussing particle physics, how how that works, and I don't know, things of that nature. But hey, you guys can always um, suggest topics. So now, um, wh when I discuss hacking, like right now, I'm referring to the hacking in like a uh, in a computer security context. So for those, I'm gonna explain it right now. But for those of you that don't know what hacking is or for those of you that live overseas and use it by a different colloquial term other than hacking I don't know uh, hacking of course in the uh, computer security context hacking is the seeking and exploitation of weaknesses in a computer system network computer itself things like that and uh, there really are a lot of distinctions between hacking as a as the uh, as um, society portrays it and uh, other types of hacking now uh, hackers of course by extension are people that actually seek and uh, exploit this weakness in the computer system network 
And uh, they there could be like a multi multitudes of um, reasons why these uh, m people are motivated motivated to do so, such as like profit. Uh, because uh, I don't know, I'm not a hacker myself, but I do believe that people that hack would receive some form of uh, currency in whatever country they're in, or they, yeah, they'd be paid for their work that they do. Protests, such as, uh, I really don't know what kind of a hacker would use hacking as a form of protest. If you guys know, you are welcome to do so in the, in the uh, comment section below. And, uh, of course, whoa, 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 let's slow down a bit. Um, I forgot to bring up something that's pretty vital to this playlist that I'm going to be coming up with. Well, that's already coming out, but I have yet to name. So that if I ever, if my information is not 100% accurate, correct in that matter, uh, you guys are always welcome to correct me because I don't know everything. I do have to look these things up and try to get my best knowledge of it in time to prepare a commentary. So that's not really the best time. I've only had about an hour or two to like freshen up on this situation about what hacking is, all this stuff, get get you this information. So I don't know at all with 100% accuracy. If you guys ever feel that something I said was incorrect, please, by all means, I encourage you to correct me. I don't want to be feeding you guys like false information. Uh, and I actually would appreciate it if you would give some feedback in that of that sort if I'm ever incorrect. And uh, while there there are some uses of the word like hacker and hacking that are in a are not in a, are not related to computer security, uh, mainstream context has brought the term hacking to um, bring about the um, exploitation of computer systems. Now there are several subgroups of this uh, computer underground system with um, and different people have different attitudes to uh, distinguish themselves from other groups of hacking to, to uh, others. The main two are like white hacking white hacking or white hackers and uh, black black hat hatters. So um, the things I'm going to be discussing here is uh, black hat hacking and that is the um, hacker that actually the illegal hacking, the one that violates computer security for like a uh, little reason beyond their personal intent for like profit and things of their nature and um, they're the actual they're the stereotypical hackers that are um, the illegal hacking groups often portrayed in like uh, social popular popular culture of that sort and uh, that's the actual hacking that some people fear in their in society. Now the other type of hacking is or hackers are the white hat hackers and these are very uh, different from the black hat hackers in that the white hat it breaks um, the computer security for non malicious uh, non personal reasons and that's largely because it's their job they're employed to do so perhaps to like test their own security system or while working for their a security company but um, the first uh, going back to black hat hacking, the, f the three steps that mainly hackers do to get into the network is first their the first thing they do would be like to target their uh, target the network or the thing that they're going to break into. Uh, the second thing they do is like research and gather their information, and the third thing they do is to like finish or like um, actually bring about the attack on the network to do um, to do whatever there is they're going to do. Now I know you guys. Th um, I'm actually going. I'm actually doing pretty well for my first 10-minute commentary. Uh, but yeah, this thing applies to my channel because that recently. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but recently I do. My channel has been hacked. I know it's kind of ironic. I'm bringing about a um, commentary on hacking, whereas my channel just about a week ago got hacked. But I think it was just for. Uh, I brought. I, Put up, I put up this commentary for that exact reason. I wanted to explain what hacking was to you guys and explain w just what happened to my channel that week. I don't know if you guys are on the forums listening to this, but yeah, my channel got hacked by someone that posted um, images on my background that weren't too appropriate that I wouldn't consider to be representing my views. 
so I apologize for that and uh, that really bums me because people unsubscribed from my channel and I do not know if it was because of that specific reason that my channel images got um, changed to things that may have been offensive or whatever reason but I apologize for that uh, right now as we're approaching the end of the commentary I'm reflecting back on how I actually did do this commentary and I actually do I feel that I was pretty prepared for this I mean just two hours of trying to researching of researching 